Today I'm going to talk about an issue that I always encounter with my FJ Cruiser and that is the fact that my coolant reservoir is always crusting up at the top here. Um, you can see that I've cleaned it up a little bit but previously um, I had uh, a bunch of crust on uh, the perimeter of the cap here and uh, you can see that it's kind of dripping down the side of the reservoir and also I don't know if it's easy to see but there's uh, also some residue going down the side of the plastic covering there um, that's sort of protecting that radiator. As long as I can remember with my ownership of this car um, I've always had a little bit of crust coming out of here. So the reservoir isn't a pressurized uh, container so there is no need to have any sort of uh, like rubber gasket underneath here but I'm just gonna go ahead and clean this off but yeah so when you pull off this tubing you can see that there's a little bit of uh, coolant crusted on there so clearly the coolant has kind of uh, you know kind of seeped over and uh, kind of caked on there but um, what I also did was I uh, sort of tightened the connection here, uh, this tubing, I just sort of pushed it in a little bit further and then just kind of made sure that that tubing is also firmly connected to the radiator uh, opening here. But right now I'm just going to clean off all of this crust, just kind of making sure that nothing gets into that reservoir. And I'm going to drive it around you know obviously make sure that the cap is, is sealed shut again and then I will drive it around for about a week and then see if any more crusting continues. If you take a look at the level of my coolant it's right at the F full line and this is a on a cold engine I have not driven this car at all today there's the F line right there's the L line so it's not really exceeding the the limit here as the engine gets hot uh, there is some expansion in the coolant system so um, I'm guessing that the uh, the crusted coolant is a result of the you know the heated expansion you know I've ensured that I have clear tubes um, I've had the there's the, there's no blockage in the tubing I've ensured the connection on the tube from the, uh, the the cap here to the radiator, making sure there's a tight snap on the lid when I put it back on. It is possible that I may have a little bit too much, so if I continue to get crust on the lid here, I'm going to take down about an inch of fluid and then uh, see if that works. So um, I'll go ahead and drive the car just like this for another week and then see what happens. And just drove the car around. Temperature has been up to normal operating temperatures, and here we go. Coolant reservoir is looking pretty good. So really, I think the issue was that maybe that this uh, escape uh, tube was a little bit clogged. Um, it really wasn't clogged at all. But really, what I did was I opened it up and I. Uh, you know, just kind of cleaned it all out. There was a little bit of crust in there, but uh, that was it. And then I just made sure that the cap was back on. So clearly no issues uh, with the coolant system. So I'm happy about that. So uh, that's it. So I'll check back again next week. Uh, we're going to be doing a long drive uh, over a hundred miles or so. And uh, we'll see you. We'll see how that holds up uh, next week. It just completed a drive home. This is the round trip mileage here on a single tank of gas, 269. Literally just finished driving uh, almost two hours. So coolant level should be sort of at its peak. So far, everything's looking good. No overspill, no crust. Coolant level looks pretty good. And everything looks normal so that is very encouraging
just checking up on the coolant again. Uh, it looks like the reservoir is nice and clean here. There is no overspill. So we're looking pretty good here. I think I'm pretty satisfied with the results here. I don't think I really need to do anything else. Um, so bottom line is if you notice any overspill all over the reservoir container like I used to, then uh, check the check to see that this tube isn't clogged.